So let's talk about how psoriasis actually occurs. So the main cause is due to infiltration of CD3 T cells and CD11 C plus dendritic cells into the skin. These cells are part of the immune system. Once these cells go inside the skin, it causes the release of pro-inflammatory mediators. So these are certain molecules which cause inflammation in the skin. And these pro-inflammatory mediators are things like tumor necrosis factor and interleukin-7. The overall effect of this is the activation of keratinocytes. Now, in normal, healthy skin, keratinocytes make up most of the epidermis. So they're produced from the basal layer and throughout their life cycle of 21 days, they just migrate to the surface and lose their nucleus. In cases of psoriasis, this process of the migration of these keratinocytes, which make keratin by the way, the migration to the surface only takes three to five days and they don't lose their nucleus. So what's happening is these keratinocytes which are making the keratin, which is an important component of skin, these keratinocytes are immature and eventually you can just scrape them off the skin surface and this is known as ospit sign. So that's just the fundamental concepts of psoriasis. We have these keratinocytes which migrate to the surface of the skin in normal cases but in cases of psoriasis it happens very fast and these keratinocytes are very immature so they're not properly developed.